Blow You tutorial and review. Features, walkthrough, and everything you need to know. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we will be doing a quick review and tutorial of how you can get started with Flow You. And Flow You is an amazing tool that enables you to work comprehensively, and it is a comprehensive project management and CRM tool designed to help you streamline your business operations. Whether you're a small business owner or part of a larger team, Flowu can help you manage your tasks, projects, and finances, and customer relationships all in one platform. Now, with all these amazing features on Flowu, if you want to get started, you can use our discount code MANIZERYAN to get a 20% percent discount and this is a recurring discount so you can get 20 percent off of your subscription on flow you now let's get started now the first thing we're going to do is sign up so you guys can actually see step by step how you can get started with flow you and once you click on sign up over here you can get started for free and with our discount as well and we are just going to input our email address over here and then I'm just going to verify I'm not a robot. Now you have the option to also sign in with Google or Apple. And I'm just going to input my email and click on get started. After that, I can put in my name. And then we are just going to enter our company name as well. And then after that, you can enter the number of employees that your company has. So we're just going to go with one to five. And then you're going to choose your industry. As you guys can see that Flowu enables you to work in any industry and you can build your CRM projects, finance, agile project management, and so much more directly in Flowu. So whatever industry you're working in, Flowu is the tool for you. Now I'm going to go with marketing and advertising and I will click on next. And then after that, I will just enter these questions and then we're going to click on start working to complete our account setup. Now, Flowu has even things such as a knowledge base. So if you have your own employees that are looking for more information about their own products to better establish how you're going to work in your ticketing system and more, then having a knowledge base for your own employees can be a great guide for them to get started. However, if you even have products that people are using, having a knowledge base for those products can also be very helpful in making sure the best quality is delivered so once you have completed your sign up process this is going to be your dashboard now as you guys can see this is just some sample data that flow you has provided now you will see on the top left you have your home section that will be segregated into two sections you have a dashboard and then you have a feed section so this is the primary dashboard section where you can see a summary of all the things that are happening then you have a feed section that is going to actually show you the most recent activity then you can click on this plus icon to actually build a new view in your home section now moving on to the next tool is your tasks tool so if you click on tasks on the left panel you will see you have multiple different types of views you have a to-do list that you can build for yourself you have a list view and a kanban board view that can help you in building tasks and projects for your entire team so if i click on the kanban board over here you guys can see we have multiple different tasks that have been added and you even have templates that can help you in getting started with building your tasks. So we're just going to open up a couple of tasks in our board views. Now, as you guys can see, this is a Kanban board for our tasks and you guys can see they have been segregated on the basis of their completion. So these are things that need to be done. These are in progress and done and then completed. Now, you guys can see if you want to build anything. So if I have a new task that is certainly in progress, I can just click on add over here. And I can enter my task. So we are maybe building a content calendar or building a marketing plan like this. And then you can just enter a new task. Plus, you can provide multiple different detailed elements within your task as well. So you can open up your task and you will see you have the options to create a checklist or a subtasks within a task. You also have your feed and the time that you have spent on one particular task. And you have the option to actually record the time that you are spending on one task. 
Now on the right panel over here, you will have the options to set your start time and end date as well, as well as the priority of your task, the owner and assignee, as well as the task list that it belongs to. So other than keeping your tasks organized in the form of the progress, you can also organize them based on the category that they belong to. Now, after that, they have an amazing comprehensive CRM tool on FlowU. So going into the CRM section over here, you can go into your all account section to start adding contacts and organizations, and you can build a hierarchy where you add one organization and you can add multiple different contacts that belong to the same organization. To do that, simply click on create on the top right and you can start adding information about the organization and then you can set the category. So let's say this is a customer and they're in the apparel industry. You can enter their website, phone, email, description, full legal names, as as well as any additional information you want, any addresses and contact details. Once you do that, you can just click on save over here and then you can proceed with adding any important tags as well as any important or relevant information. Now, after you add your contacts or your organizations in your CRM, you have more features that can help you in organizing your customer response. So. As you guys can see, you have your opportunity section over here. And if you open up your opportunity section, this will show you all of your incoming deals, your negotiating deals, qualified deals, and more. And you can click on the plus icon to get started with building more pipelines to be able to further categorize your items. Now moving on to our next section, we have our project section, which can help you in achieving a certain goal or milestone and you can set milestones to achieve a certain goal so you can see you have a project you have your status customers and then the stage of your project so you can set particular due dates for projects as well as individual and potential expenses as well as financial tracking then our next section is the group section on FlowU, which can enable you into categorizing different teams. So you might have a senior management team like we have in this data set over here. You might have a marketing team, a finance team, and you can separate them to make it easier for those groups to work alongside each other. Next up, you have your finances section, which can help you in building your payment calendar, your recurring invoices, any invoices you have to generate, as well as providing estimates of your expenditure. Next up, you have your team section, and then you actually have a very important section, which is your agile project management. So you can open up your projects over here to take a look at any of your active projects. So we're going to click on over here and we can, you know, build a specific project that is built with agile tools. So you can have a cycling or a sprinting tool within your project, and this can be a great way to get started. You can just click on get started over here enter a title over here and you can enter a unique prefix and we're just going to click on save over here and you can choose which type of issues would be added so if it would be a task-based project and what are the issues that are going to be incurred within this particular task so within this you can see you're going to have a board and you have multiple different segregations within that you have project details issues and automation within your agile project manager now, moving on to our last section on FlowU, we have our knowledge base. So our knowledge bases can help in improving the overall customer experience. You guys can see they have knowledge bases with different data sets provided so this can help you in building your own knowledge base and this can include all of your faqs as well as more info about how to use your product service or your application now in general for you is a amazing tool that is definitely worth the price because you're getting a all-in-one tool for such a low price now they even have a free version where you get access to certain features however their team and business versions are pretty low priced you guys can see with a one month plan you can get the team version for only $39 per month for up to eight users then you have the business version starting at $74 per month and then you have the professional plan starting at $149 and enterprise at $249 
Now you can use our code Maniza Ryan to get a 20% discount for your entire building. So use that code at checkout and it will be provided in the description that can help you in getting a amazing discount on this amazing tool. Generally speaking, I do think this is a great tool even for beginners and for newer businesses as well because it integrates all the features you need and instead of having to do it separately on multiple different platforms, it really builds all in one. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.